This is KCCK's Culture Crawl. I'm Dennis Green, and my guest today is Don Jones from the Iowa Cultural Corridor Alliance, yeah. ICA for short. Uh, stops by every few weeks to talk about things going on in the community. Welcome, Don. Thank you for having me, Dennis. I appreciate it. Off the air, we were talking about how all of a sudden we're on the backside of summer. That's right. It's so and hard to believe. Yes, it uh, is has is gone fast and is going fast, but... Still a lot of fun things to do. There are. So what have you picked off the calendar that you like this week? Well, I mean, July is buzzing with events. So um, let's let's get started with the Washington County Fair that's happening now through Friday. So um, that's it's a week filled with events. So all the fair stuff, out. food, rides, music, animals, everything. See all the baby goats. Oh, yes, absolutely. Yeah. So check out that Washington County Fair. Um, Old Creamery Theater is performing Apples in the Winter this weekend, and that runs through July 28th. Starring the great Marquita Centers. Yeah. And she's going to be in later on this week, so we'll oh. have a chance to talk with her about that. It's a very powerful and uh, moving one-woman show. Oh, great. Well, I can't wait to hear more about it this week when she comes in. Let's see. Um, this Friday in Iowa City, the Summer of the Arts is having the Friday Night Concert Series featuring B.F. Burt and Big Medicine, and that's being held on the North Side Marketplace beginning at 6.30. So this is one of the once a month they're coming off the Ped Mall yep. and going up to the North Side Marketplace for a little change of pace. Yep. And, of course, our audience, we don't have to explain who Kevin B.F. Oh. Burt He's amazing. Is winner of the International Blues Challenge. Oh, yeah. uh, and uh, so we're so thrilled that he is still, you know, picking up gigs here locally oh, in between absolutely. his tours around the country and in Europe and places like that. Yeah, he's fantastic. So if you have the time, go see him. He's, he's absolutely amazing. Um, now through September 1st, the Cedar Rapids Art Museum is holding free summer admission. So the public is now able to visit as often as they want. And they can view 16 galleries. So check that out. Free. Free. So I'm looking forward to going this mm -hmm. summer. Yeah. Well, and yeah. Uh, the air conditioning always yeah. works <laughs> at, the, uh, at the art museum. Because not, it's not, and it's not for you. It's not for you. It's for the paintings. That's right. Yeah. That's yeah. right. It, exactly. it, the fact that it's comfortable for you is simply a pleasurable byproduct. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, yeah, head, that, head to the Cedar Rapids Art Museum. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, Amana will be holding Kinderfest this Saturday. So join the family-friendly event and meet firemen and dogs, create crafts, play games, and take part in a scavenger hunt. Oh, fun. <laughs> yeah. So that'll be fun. Head to Amana. And last but not least on my list is Jazz Under the Stars. Which is going to be here before we know it. Yeah. We're just hardly two weeks away from the first Jazz Under the Stars. Yeah. Uh, we begin, it's early, early by our standards this year because yes. the first one is on August 1st. August 1st. Yeah. Uh, and that will be Grizz's Big Fun, Steve Grismore. Mm -hmm. And then we'll also have a student combo. For the first time, we're going to oh. have student groups uh, performing at 6.30 ahead of the main concert. Oh, nice. And so the first one of those then will be at 6.30 just ahead of mm -hmm. Big Fun. First three concerts in Knoll Ridge as usual, and then we wrap up at the McGrath Amphitheater. Yeah. Well, thank you for including great. that, even though it's yeah. a couple of weeks away. Oh, well, I'm looking forward to it. Well, so. these and hundreds of more, hundreds more yes. items on your calendar and website. Yeah. So uh, plug culturalcorridor.org a little bit. Yes. So please, yes, visit our calendar on culturalcorridor.org. It has all the events for arts, culture, and entertainment here in the corridor. And also like us on Facebook and Twitter. Okay. We appreciate it. All right. Don, thanks for Thank being you. here. Thanks for having me, Dennis. Have a good day. Don Jones from the Iowa Cultural Corridor Alliance, purveyor of the fine website, culturalcorridor.org, and other things as well. You can hear the Culture Crawl live on the radio most Thursdays and Fridays and the occasional Tuesday during the summer as well, mornings at 1020, or download the podcast, watch or listen on your own schedule, however you get podcasts, or at kcck.org slash culture. I'm Dennis Green.